Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am sitting down to do a fall toddler clothing haul. I have been shopping and I'm trying to redo my daughter's closet. I'm trying to do it more timeless. I would love to have it be a capsule wardrobe. I don't know if that's actually going to happen, but I am trying to only find pieces for the fall and from here on out that are really just going to mix and match with other items and that's my goal. So in today's video, I have a ton of stuff to show you all. I have so many different style of clothes to show you and so many different brands, including Target, uh, children clothing resale shops. A tea collection. Hopefully this video gives you guys some inspiration on what to buy for your toddler's fall clothing wardrobe. I also want to mention that there is a giveaway going on in today's video as well. I have partnered with Tea Collection. I've done this a couple times before and you guys loved it. If you guys are unfamiliar with the brand Tea Collection, they carry both girl and boy. They carry from newborn all the way up to tween girl and tween boy sizes. So they carry a wide variety of items. Everything that they carry is such high quality. We've been shopping Tea Collection for the past year now and everything that we have got from Tea Collection always holds up in the wash. It doesn't fade. Their items are a little bit more expensive than say running to Target or something to pick up a shirt, but they definitely last and that's why I love them. You're definitely getting what you pay for when you do shop Tea Collection. You can shop Tea Collection directly from their website, teacollection.com. I've also seen them at Nordstrom and Nordstrom Rack. I know at Nordstrom Rack you can get some really good deals on Tea Collection items there too, which is pretty cool, but I am going to be giving away a hundred dollar shop credit to tea collection in today's video so one lucky winner is going to be able to get some fun things for fall stick around to the end of the video and I will explain how you can enter to win yourself a hundred dollar shop credit to tea collection but don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you guys like haul videos I know I don't do a ton on my channel but if you want to see more make sure to hit that thumbs up also if you're new here I would love to have you as a subscriber so make sure you hit that red subscribe button so you can see more videos like this all right let's go ahead and get started with the video the very first item that I'm going to show you guys are all items from Tea Collection and from their new fall line. But everything that I got from Tea Collection, I really just tried to get pieces that would mix and match with each other. So there could be multiple outfits built out of these pieces. So let me start with the leggings that I got from Tea Collection. These might look familiar because I had these last year. My daughter wore these so much last year when I saw that they had them back in stock for this fall. I had to go get them for her. They're just a gray and white striped legging. I just felt like these matched with so many different things, so I got her another pair of those. Uh, these are some new style of leggings that they just got in for their fall collection, and I am so in love. These are kind of like a knit legging, so this is a charcoal color. Um, these would be great for layering. Honestly, I would just let her wear these with a cute little t-shirt because I think that would be cute too, and some boots or something like that. I also got them in this blush color. You guys are probably going to notice that I like a lot of neutral colors, I like denim, I like blushes. Those are kind of my color scheme and what I like to put my daughter in. However, I'm not strict on it, like sometimes we'll wear a bright colored shirt or something, but that if I'm shopping, that's what I'm trying to shop for is those neutral colors. So this was a fun little legging. I love the grid print and I think those will go with so many things that I got. I am so excited about these. These are so cute. If you guys remember, she actually has denim overall shorts that are just like this, but they made a denim jean overall that are identical to the short overall that she has that she wore so much this summer. But I think these are so cute and I just, I'm obsessed. I think they're gonna be adorable on her. One thing I really like about these is that this, like the straps, you tie them in a knot at the end so you can really adjust it to fit your child. This little dress I've had my eye on for a while too and this is just a staple to have in a closet. So this is just a cute little denim dress. I have not washed these items yet. I've washed everything else, but I have not got a chance to wash this stuff yet. So tags are still on it, but um, that's what it looks like. It's just this cute little little jumper dress. In the back it crosses. My favorite style of dress on Scarlett. Okay, so I got this shirt in two different colors, and it's just a little blush pink ruffled sleeve. I love that. How cute is that? It's just a basic, but it's also like it has some style to it. So that's why I like it. So what I was thinking would be really cute, kind of something like this. And then when it is a little bit colder, pairing it with these leggings, I think that would be such a cute look. And then some boots. So I, I just have so many different ideas to do with this dress. I think it's just going to be amazing. I also got it in this color and it's just a, um, it's like a striped one. And it's, I thought it was black, but the more I look at it, it looks navy. So I think it's actually navy, but it's the same exact top, just with stripes. And again, I could pair it with the overalls, that dress. 
um, by itself really anything and then this looks super similar and I didn't realize it but I think they're like the same item except this is a dress which is fine because I know we're gonna wear this a lot but this is actually a little bit longer so this is more of a dress and then I picked up this little basic it's like an oatmeal color I feel like this could also be a great layering item or she could just wear it by itself with a sweater or whatever uh, I just I love this color first of all I love the, the oatmeal color on her and, and the quality of these basics is just unreal this is gonna last her all fall all winter unless she goes through a huge growth spurt which I hope she doesn't okay so that's everything that I got from tea collection moving on this all is just gonna be kind of random but majority of this stuff is things that I've got from secondhand stores, from children resale shops. I live in Phoenix, Arizona, if you guys are new here, but there's a Once Upon a Child and a Kid to Kid, and I really like to go hit those up every once in a while and just see what I can find. There are specific brands I look for, such as Zara. I love Zara, and I don't really shop Zara a ton, but I love everything that they have, and if I could shop Zara a ton, I would, but some of this stuff can be a little pricey, so when I find them at these kids' resale shops, I get so excited. So this is everything that I got from either Kid to Kid or um, Once Upon a Child. So I scored two Zara tops. I think I paid maybe seven or eight dollars a top when typically they're like, I don't know, thirty dollars or so. So I was really excited about this. And these have all been washed, so they're kind of wrinkly. I need to hang them up, but they've been sitting here so I could film this video. But this first one is so cute. There's little foxes and trees on it, and then there's wooden buttons down the back. And I just, I love this. This will be super cute layered underneath that dress from Tea Collection or just wearing it with these leggings from Tea Collection. I just have so many different things that we're gonna be able to do with this. So I love this top. I was so excited when I found this in her size. This top's actually a size three to four years old, but it'll be fine. It, even if it's a little big on her, it'll still look okay. And then I found this dress. This was a two to three year old size. I found this from Zara. Um, at the resale shops and I love this. I think it's so cute and perfect for fall. It has brown uh, embroidery and then there's butterflies and leaves and twigs and then it doesn't get super cold here in the fall I guess for Arizona but it does in the winter. It doesn't get cold enough to wear a sweater especially in the morning. So I did buy two sweaters for my daughter Scarlett. So this one is from Carter's and I thought it was Darlene. It's just a white color and there's little wooden buttons down the front of it. And then I also found a little gray sweater from H&M and this is a size uh, one and a half to two years. And again, perfect layering piece. I think those sweaters were maybe, I don't know, $7 or so. Um, I think the one from Carter's was $5, so I got a, such a good deal on this stuff. Okay, some more things that I got from the resale shops. I got this dress. This is from Baby Gap. And again, so cute. It's like a sweatshirt material, so this will be nice and comfortable. There's like little rose gold polka dots on that. This is a dress that she can wear now, but I also think it'll transition really good into fall. This dress is from Old Navy. I think I paid just a few dollars for it. Any of those sweaters that I got, I just, I think it'd be a really cute look. Um, I don't know if that, like, you can kind of see what I'm talking about with some leggings and some boots. So this is a piece she can wear now and then can also transition into fall as it does start to get a little bit cooler. But this sweater is from Old Navy and I've seen it at Old Navy before. I just never bought it. And when I saw it at the kids' resale shops, I immediately snagged it because these sweaters are amazing. This is super lightweight. It won't be too hot on days where she just needs something to cover her arms. Plus, it'll be the perfect layering piece. So like this with... I mean, there's so many things that this will be cute with. Like, that'll be adorable. This by itself with a pair of jeans um, and, like, a little white shirt underneath it. I just have so many ideas for this little sweater, and I know we'll get a good use out of this for fall. These jeans I picked up for $5, and I love them. They're from Cat and Jack from Target, but I love this. I love the, the heart right here, and it's, like, the distressed material. I just thought these were super cute. I love the wash. And she needed some more jeans, and so when I saw these, I picked them up. Next items I purchased at uh, Target. So I've actually showed you guys these in a vlog, I think. I wanted to include these in this video because I haven't had her wear them yet. This little shirt, it's just a plain white t-shirt from Target. And I bought these little sweatpants from Target. I think this whole outfit was like $10 or something like that. But these have little Mickey Mouse on them. And I'm not super huge into the character print and... Um, like characters on your t-shirts and stuff like that but I do like it when it's done like this I don't know like classic I guess you could say I didn't buy this this was actually sent to us by a local shop here in Phoenix it's called West End Kids & Co and this is so cute it says oh baby 
But the reason I wanted to show you this right now is because I think this would also be a cute little comfy outfit just to pair together. But I also think this would be cute with, let me show you what I'm thinking. I think this would be super cute with the, the um, mustard yellow sweater and just a pair of denim. I'll link this down below for you guys. You guys can check out the shop. They make a lot of really cute screen print tees and it's not like overdone, like they're really tasteful and that's why I like them. Okay, so I bought these two items at Old Navy and I know they're white and, um, well this one's cream, it's not white. I know you're not supposed to wear white after Labor Day, but when it comes to dressing my toddler, I feel like if I do it the right way, it might be okay, I don't know. But it is a cream colored dress and I think it's so pretty. The reason I bought this is because I have, I'll just show you guys these now because um, I was gonna wait to do accessories towards the end, but this is gonna go with this dress. So these are uh, tights from Little Stocking Company. I think that's what it's called, Little Stocking Co. I just placed an order there. This is where I buy all of her long socks and just like cute knit leggings. And I just, I think they're super cute and comfortable and good quality. We had these last year, so I just wanted to get these for her again. But I think dressing this up with, um, like for a dressier outfit with these tights and some boots and then one of those sweaters will be a really cute look for fall. I think this was a summer dress at Old Navy, but I don't think it's, I mean, I think it can transition. Plus she can still wear this now. Same with this top. I got this on sale at Old Navy and I figured it would be really cute to pair with any of those sweaters that I got. Plus she can wear it now too, but I just loved it and I had to get it for her. It was so pretty. It has like a crochet detail right here and it is off the shoulder, but it doesn't really get that cold here until like December, January and it doesn't even get that cold. I mean cold, like 60 degrees cold here, but um, she'll be able to wear this for the next couple of months too. Okay, and then this next item was sent to us by Worthy Threads and they're actually a brand that I I recently discovered and Scarlett loves. The reason she loves this brand is because they we have two dresses from there and they have a llama print and a print with chickens on it and she's just obsessed with these dresses. So when we got this in, I was really excited because I love the brand and I thought it'd be cute on her. It's a little bit brighter than things that we typically wear but I know this color is going to be gorgeous on her and I think the inside of this, look at that. How cute is that? It's like a, a dream catcher material inside with a pair of leggings or something for a comfy day. I really like that. Plus, this is super lightweight, so I'm always looking for lightweight long sleeve clothing for her because, it, like I said, it doesn't get very cold here. Okay, the next items that I have to show you guys, let me, I'll, I'll do the socks because I already showed you some. So I got these tights like I showed you earlier. They're like a, a camel color. These were the only tights I got. These. I haven't even looked at them yet. These are just some cute socks, some tall socks, and I love these for fall. This is like a mauve color or rose color. So, and these are the, the toddler sizes, I think is what it was. I really, really wanted to cream the pair, and they were out of stock of the toddler size, so I got the kid size, so hopefully they're not too big, but um, they do look awfully big. She might have to grow into these. I mean, they're really cute, but they do look awfully big. I don't think those are gonna work. She has a pair of um, like a dark green socks from last year and then a gray socks as well that we'll be wearing again this year as long as they fit. I'm pretty sure they will. Okay, so next I'm gonna move on to shoes and then I'm done showing you guys everything. I found two pairs of shoes at the resale store that I was at. Um, I'm really excited about this first pair because they are mini Melissa's and I paid $15 for them. $15, you guys, that is such an amazing deal. I got them like, I don't even know, 60, 70% off retail price. So these are the mini Melissa's that I found. Aren't those just darling? I'm so excited. They're an amazing shape. Like these look brand new. Uh, they were uh, like had some dirt on them and I just took a rag to them and wiped them off really well and I used some disinfectant spray on them and they're perfect. I mean, they're seriously as good as new. First of all, they're great quality to begin with because they're a mini Melissa shoe. The second of all, these were, I mean, you can tell they were lightly worn. I am so excited that I found these in her size. They're like a blush pink color with a black bow. They're gonna go with so many things. I also got these shoes, and these, are, I think, are from Children's Place. And she's in a size six, by the way. Yeah, these are from the Children's Place. And I was wanting to get some boots like this for the fall for her, and when I saw these, I'm like, I might as well just get those. They're in great quality. There's no scuffs or anything like that. I actually ran these through the washer just to get them really clean and they're perfect. Like they're as good as new. So 
I was excited about these, just some plain dark brown boots and they like lace up so they like the combat style. And then again, I know I showed you guys these but I wanted to include them in today's haul. I bought these at Target, so they're just these little ankle booties, that's what they look like. And they have this cute print, it's like a mauve and gold color right there and I just love the color and the style and they'll match with so many different things. Alright guys, that wraps up today's video. This was probably my favorite haul I've ever done, so I hope you guys liked it. If you guys are interested in entering the giveaway for Tea Collection, I'm going to have a link down below. All you have to do is click that link, follow the instructions, and then you will be entered for a chance to win a $100 shop credit to Tea Collection. It's super simple to enter. There are bonus entries too, so just follow the information down below. Comment below and let me know your guys' thoughts on a capsule wardrobe. I'm really trying to get in that direction with my daughter's closet. We'll see if it's sustainable, but it is something I'm shooting for. I'm really going to try to go through her closet and pull a ton of stuff just to really narrow down her items to things that can mix and match. So if you guys are interested in me putting her items on Poshmark, comment down below, let me know. I can do that. I do have a Poshmark. So let me know if that's something you guys would want to see. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you guys are new. Follow me over on Instagram if you would like to follow us along even more. Check out my vlogs. I daily vlog a lot and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.